guys, it's Julie here from Julie Aaron Designs. Today I just wanted to do a video um, demonstrating how you can create seamless patterns in the Procreate app, which is an art app for the Apple iPad. You can download it from the Apple Store. Um, I think it's about $13. It's a really great app for just artists and digital artists. I've gotten my iPad a couple months ago and I've been playing around with creating these seamless patterns and it's been really fun and so I kind of just wanted to show you guys really quick how you can create seamless patterns on the iPad. So here I'm just kind of going through and creating the elements for my pattern. So you can just create whatever elements that you want. You can follow along or if you already have some artwork that you want to use. So now I'm just finishing up and adding some other little details to my strawberries. And now I'm going to go in and separate each one onto its own layer. So I'm taking the selection tool and drawing around it and then swiping down with three fingers and hitting the cut and paste on that little dialog box that comes up until I have them all in their own layer and then just kind of arranging them so that they're kind of near the middle. I don't want anything too close to the sides and you're gonna see why uh, when we create our pattern. So now I'm just grouping them all into one group. So I'm hitting group and then duplicating that group. And then I'm opening that group up and pinching them all together into one layer. And now I'm adding a layer and filling it with a color. Now it can be any color, it doesn't matter. Turn down the opacity. And then we're gonna take the two layers with the strawberries and that color and make a group from that. And then as you can see, I select the group. Make sure you select the group and not the layer within the group. And then you're gonna turn on the snapping and magnetics under the selection tool. Um, but first I've created four copies of those groups and then with the snapping and magnetics on I'm going ahead and dragging it until you can see those little lines that come up They're kind of a yellow line. You can see there's blue lines, but you want to have it on the yellow lines So once that's done you can go ahead and delete that extra color layer because we don't need that anymore And then turning on our original group of strawberries, going in and just filling in in between those outer strawberries. And now we've actually got our seamless tile. So now I'm going to show you how you can test your tiles. We're going to go to select and then select that strawberry and duplicate it. And then we're going to go into the duplicated file and we're going to pinch everything together into one layer and then add a background. So I'm just going to make it the same color as that blue background and fill it in and then pinch them together and then duplicate that four times and again with the snapping and magnetics on like I'm demonstrating there um, just drag them into each corner so make sure it snaps to that middle part where you see the yellow lines and each one drag it to its own corner And there we have our seamless pattern design. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And we'll see you in the next one. Cheers.